Hello everyone! In today's video, I figured I'd show you guys a bit of behind the scenes of how I make my videos. So, without further ado, let's get into it! So, usually what I do is I will go over and adjust the height on my chair to make sure that it's level or the height that I want it to be. Then I will move it into the position that you're, I usually have it at, right in front of the TV. Move the table as well, get it in front of there where I have enough room to walk to the chair. Grab the tripod, get that into position where it needs to be so it's center within the frame of the shot. So you have both of the shelves and the TV all in frame. The iPad situated on the stand. Make sure everything's level and where I want it to be. Do some adjustments there. Make sure everything's all good. And then I'll grab the movie that I will be doing for that video, set it down, and start the video. And this is my view that I see while I'm making the videos. After the video, I will go into LumaFusion on the iPad, select the clip that I want, drag it into the timeline and start editing. Start cutting pieces that don't need to be included within the video. Let me cutting some parts there. This is for the Matrix video that was uploaded last week. So cutting the parts that I don't want. Using the magic trackpad and magic keyboard. Just scrubbing through the timeline there. Getting everything how I want it. Then, once I get to the end, I will go into my albums, select the YouTube folder that I have for all of my outros for the like, comment, and subscribe bits. Add those in. Just drag them all in individually to the correct placement. Make sure I have the right ones because there's been a couple of times where I've selected the wrong ones. And I have all the outros that I need. The like, comment, subscribe, notification bell, PayPal, and now the new Q&A section. I will go in and individually select them and put the green screen filter on. So that way you don't get that black page. You just see me and the effect. So do this individually for every single one. Can be very tedious and I'm sure you're probably thinking there's an easier way to do it, but this is just the way that I found that works for me. If any of you are familiar with LumaFusion and know a faster way to do this, let me know down in the comments. getting everything applied that I need to, scrubbing through the timeline, getting the last effect in place, and then once everything looks good I will go over and upload the clip, go to the YouTube tab, and upload, make sure everything looks good, have all the settings set, and then I will add my title for the video. And then I will start uploading. And that's it for today. If you enjoyed it, as always, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want miss any more of these videos. And if you feel like helping out, you can donate via PayPal in the link below. If you don't want to do that, perfectly understandable. I appreciate you keep coming back and watching the videos. And if you have any questions or anything you'd like to know or any video suggestions, leave them down in the comments and I will answer them in the next video or try to do a suggestion in the future. Once again, that's it for today. I will see you guys in the next one. Have a great day!